morning so lovely to be able to send a little video out to you all it's felt really bizarre over the last few weeks not being able to speak to you or see you at school but I hope you're all staying safe and keeping well and all you and your families are really safe too okay that's the main thing that's really really important over this time um, I just wanted to send out a quick video just to introduce what's planned over the next few weeks leading up to the summer um, we want to be able to support you a little bit more at home um, so now we're introducing a email address per year group um, and that email address for year five is year five at webster.manchester.sch.uk okay so that's year five at the beginning um, and your parents or yourselves can send any email to, to me and I will reply as soon as I possibly can any questions, it doesn't matter how silly you think it is, it really isn't. If they found something in your learning pack that you're not sure about, email me and I'll try and support you and send you something. Or maybe send you an email to explain a little bit further what's meant by that task. It can be any questions at all. It doesn't even have to be about your learning. If you've got questions about what's happening at school that I can answer, I'm more than happy to answer anything and support you and your family as much as I possibly can. Um, what I have been able to check so far, obviously, and keep an eye on you and see what's going on is your mathletics and your reading eggs. And there's a number of children that have really, really impressed and from lockdown have, you know, I can tell you trying to continue your learning and continue to keep your brain active. Um, I don't expect you to be doing hours and hours in a day. And I'm more than sure that your parents have other, maybe other activities for you to do and to do some learning, which is absolutely fine. Um, but I would like um, you to continue. You, you're going to be year six in a matter of weeks, which is scary, isn't it? But you are. And school will return as normal at some point. So um, just keep a few activities going in a, in a week and that will, will really, really pay dividends. Um, and just keep that brain active and keep that information in your head. Okay, so first of all, I just want to do a few shout outs um, for children who have been accessing the old athletics. Now, I have been doing a few tweets over the week, uh, last few weeks. I don't know if you've seen them. I did one today. Um, but um, there's three children in particular that have been outstanding with math mathletics and have spent over 10 hours over the last 10, 11 weeks. So that's at least an hour a week, which, you know, obviously is definitely showing me that they're trying to keep that brain active with their maths. Um, and in third place for 10 hours of access is Eamon. Well done, Eamon. Second place with 10 and a half hours is Mohammed. And then uh, for 16 hours, in first place is Abdul Shakur. So well done, you three boys. So girls, come on, we need to get going. Um, but there's definitely some amazing girls in there, such as Gianna, Iptisam Lily, Sarah, Iman, all been accessing it for more than two hours, up to six hours, which is amazing. And then I've got Luckman and Amari and Ryan, um, who've all been accessing for, for at least two to seven hours which is fantastic well done everybody okay keep that up um with regards to reading eggs we've had less of an access on reading eggs and we do know that there's amazing and abundance amount of books on there that you can just read for pleasure so if you're doing that then that's absolutely fine um that's amazing that's brilliant but reading is a huge part of your year six curriculum um and I really want you to ensure, especially if you, you, English is a second language at home, it's really important that you continue to read and speak in English at some point over your day or your week, just to keep that going, okay, just to support you, just bear that in mind. Um, but I just want to give out shout out to, so my top three again, Yasser, which is brilliant, well done Yasser, 10 hours on reading eggs, um, Iman, well done, good girl, 13 hours on reading eggs. And I've got Sarah there, just tipped to the post at 13 and a half hours. Okay, so well done, you top three children, fantastic. Um, 
just want to mention Gabriel, eight hours, Yolanis, six, and Abdul Shakur, five hours, and then I've got Lily and Toba and Iptisam at just over an hour, between an hour and an hour and a half. Okay, I know you've got loads of you got books at home, so you might not necessarily be just doing all your reading on Read Next, which is completely understandable. Okay, but do you remember, try and keep those core subjects going at home, um, and I hope the home learning packs will help with your science, get some hands-on um, science activities in your topic, learning about the Victorians, okay? Um, oh, oh, sorry, this is hard when it's live, isn't it? On Friday, um, by Friday, there'll be another video. I'm going to hope to actually um, post every Wednesday. So if I say every Wednesday, I'm going to post a little video. I've been keeping an eye on your mathletics, seeing what you're struggling with on there. So I'm going to do a few little short like teacher input videos um, to try and help support you with your maths and things that, that seems to be of a struggle for some of you and that's accessing mathletics. So I'll do a little bit of um, teacher input, maybe 20 minutes or so, set you some tasks and you can do that at any point by accessing the school website and going into the year five section, okay, um, just where your home learning packs are as well. So if you keep an eye, out, an eye out for those on Wednesday, every Wednesday I'll post one. I might even post two because I'm thinking of also doing um, a bit of support on your reading with your writing links around Wonder, okay, which is a fantastic book. So don't know if you've been able to access that yet. Um, the PDF is on there for you to access and start reading it. Um, and it's a really, really lovely book with lots of different um, themes throughout it so we can discuss some of those. Um, I'd love to see some of your work. I've not seen any of your work yet on show me your work email but I would love to see some of your work that you are producing because I'm sure there's lots of really hard work going on at home. Okay so that's it for me for now. Um, look after yourselves and uh, look out for my video on Wednesday. All right bye.